Hello? I did not mean to have the capture card still up, but there we go. Anyway, we're doing something a little different there today. We're gonna play some Pikman. Got a little custom banner for it on this. It doesn't normally have a banner. I mean, it does, but it's usually just like generic GameCube, you know? Anyway, hang on. Gotta load. Would I like to display in progressive scan? Yes. Now, I'm not sure what color setting to do. Need to see if the, the blacks are good here. Don't want it to get cr crushed. No black crush, please. But I mean, that looks pretty good. Oh, well, this is, this is a good way to test the volume, honestly. Okay, so. Probably louder. Check, check, test. Maybe 10. Check. Check. Test. Alright. Demo. 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 Test. Testing. 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 What do you think? This? Maybe... Maybe right here? Or a little louder? First time playing. Yep. Well, sort of. Basically, uh, I kind of messed around with this game with cheats one time, like, many years ago. But this is my first time playing it legit. Anyway, let's, let's get into it. Just, you can let me know if the stuff is good. Sound. Stereo, yes. Y yeah. Rumble. I mean, I'm using I'm using a wave bird. So I don't got rumble. <laughs> That's the one downside to using a wave bird. Anyway, uh, let me know if, like I said, let me know if the blacks look like the dark colors in this look like a little crushed. Because like I don't know. Because when I do it on YUI, it looks a little like faded. This, like, looks the best, but I want to make sure that it's not, like, making things too dark. Because that was a problem with Metroid Prime when I played it. Do you have experience with any other Pikmin game? Not really. Creating a Pikmin save file. Okay. Works for me. Sonic CD music. Uh-oh. Where is my enormous rock? Oh, that's not good. I hate when that happens. Especially when you just got done paying off the rocket ship. You know, if I had a nickel... For every video game I knew of, where you're an alien that crash lands on a very Earth-like planet and has to recover their ship parts, I would have two nickels. Which isn't a lot, but it's weird it happened twice. My name is Captain Olimar. When, while traveling through space, my ship was struck by a meteor. I must have blacked out, and I awoke on the surface of a weird planet. 
With so many parts lost, the skeletal hull of my beloved dolphin is a painful sight. The engine is gone. I'm stranded. To make matters worse, my atmospheric sensors indicate this planet's environment contains high levels of poisonous oxygen. My life support systems can function for only 30 days. If I can't repair the dolphin by then, no, better not to think about it. I must find the missing ship parts. Hang on, let me... I just gotta check something real quick. Over here. Yeah, it's good. Okay, so... I'm a little feller. Don't want to get any of that oxygen in you. Hmm. I cannot do anything with this. Oh. A strange thing has appeared before me. I had barely begun my search when it reared up as if it were waiting for me. It then dropped a single seed. What is it? Is it alive? Is it a machine? It, re it resembles a vegetable on my home planet that we call an onion. So I shall call this an onion too. GameCube version, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm trying. Oh. The seed that the onion dropped took root in the soil and has now produced an adorable little sprout. The sprout emits a strange light, and it sways back and forth without benefit of the wind. I cannot help but think it is calling to me. I am compelled. I must approach it. Approach it and press A. This is a little feller. Extraordinary. When I plucked the sprout, it turned out to be a living creature, not a plant. Why can't it be both? Picking it has done no visible damage. It just stands there, staring at me. Its shape is similar to the Pick Pick brand carrot I love so much. I believe I should call it a Pikmin. Here I am, stranded on a toxic planet, fighting to survive, and yet I'm intrigued. I must research this fascinating creature. I shall try to grab it and throw it with A. I will call it to my side with B. Hmm, and perhaps it will react to C and X as well. The following controls appear to allow me several vo viewpoints. Rotate camera, zoom in and out, change angle. I must survive. I need to familiarize myself with these controls and my surrounding. So yeah, like center, zoom out, zoom out even more. And I can make him go around. Grab this, grab that, grab it. Okay, maybe I gotta throw you at it. Eh. Yeah, get it. Get it. One. <laughs> One. But wait, that was that was two. Astonishing. The onion has sown more seeds. The small red pellet the Pikmin harvested after cutting down a flower appears to be some type of food that can propagate more Pikmin. The onion appears to be some sort of incubator. Needless to say, I must study this more. I accidentally hit the B button, I'm sorry. Yeah, so get get onion. Get get more. Yeah, yeah, get more. We must we must increase increase the number of picks. There actually is a logic to spawning two from the one pellet. What is it? Okay, so... Oh, real far out. Okay. So there's a box. Is that, like, I need ten of them? Yeah, that's not enough. Come, come my sons. Oh, oh, there we go. Hang on. You guys get this one. Two of you. 
If Pikmin color matches the pellet they bring back, they will bring two- they will spawn two instead of one. Fascinating, so you get like a- a match bonus. Very cool. Oh yeah, that's the information. Yeah, and you get a whole bunch of picks. You know what, while, while I pick these guys, I'm gonna go ahead and have two of these dudes carrying this. You need to delegate, you need to learn how to delegate. If you tap A, he'll pick- keep picking them automatically. Good. Good tip. Good tip. I don't like that he turns pale. That, that doesn't seem healthy. Okay, anything up here? I- I can't go up there. I mean, maybe he can? Well, I don't know. Whatever, we're gonna do- we're gonna do with this first. Crush! Maybe if I just like... Oh, okay, they push it. Okay, I, I thought we were gonna crush the box. And it's built a bridge as well. The Pikmin are as curious as children. They form groups to perform tasks that wouldn't be be impossible for an individual. A glimmer of hope has begun to shine in my heart. If I can make use of their skills, perhaps I can fix my ship. I shall sum all up I've learned in terms of Pikmin conduct. Approach and press A to pick sprouts. Press A to grab Pikmin. Release to throw. Press B to call them. Press X to dismiss. Use C to command and control the group. L, R, and Z control perspective. I shall record all of this in my computer. I can press Y to access the computer. So, if I press X, yeah, they all go pale. So, if I want to, like, scope something out without the Pikmin. That guy's having a bit of a jive down there. Amazing! There's no mistaking it. My ship's engine rests before my very eyes. By a stroke of pure luck, I have already stumbled onto the most important piece of my damaged craft. Fate has smiled upon me. But how will I get it back to the dolphin? Come on. Come on, my dude. Oh wait, we, we might not have enough. Might not have enough duders. Yeah, not, not nearly enough duders. We must... We must obtain more. Yes. Oh, spin. Spin. You know what? Can you can you grab that one? Thank you. All right, cool. Cool bean. Hey, fellers. I I like doing this. We <laughs> When many Pikmin seeds sprout at once, I find it rather tedious to pluck them from the ground individually. My wife always told me I was no good at routine tasks. I guess I'll try to get it all done at once by repeatedly tapping A until pick I pick all the Pikmin from the ground. Yeah, so he says that right there. 
I noticed that when I had Pikmin to my group, they become filled with excitement and flush with a bright color. At other times, they revert to a paler hue and give off a dim glow. Paying close attention to these differences is bound to help me distinguish between Pikmin. Yeah, handy. Handy stuff, and it tells me how many I got at the bottom there. So I got 23 mins. Now we shall go and retrieve. Oh yeah, Nintendo making real heavy use of them analogs. Like you can, you can slowly have the camera like rotate. Hang on. Well, at least I thought. Like slowly rotate around. Oh no, it's doing it. It's doing it. I think, I don't know. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. I want, I want them to keep going. Okay, put it in. Put the money in the bag. That should be enough, right? Oh, glorious. With the help of these Pikmin, I've taken a huge step back towards home. My ship can once again lift off. The glimmer of hope is beginning to burn more brightly. But what has become of the remaining parts? That search starts tomorrow. Yeah, it's a tutorial day. They go back into the onion. And I go back into my ship. With a convenient rainbow tractor beam. But there is much yet to explore. I have somehow managed to launch the dolphin, but I was surprised to see the onion lift off with me. Perhaps the Pikmin cannot survive overnight on the planet's surface, or have they merely decided to join me for other reasons? Either way, it seems they will help me again tomorrow. The dolphin is missing 29 parts. If I can't recover them all, I may never return home to my family on planet Hockatate. Analysis shows life support systems will function for only 25 more- 29 more days. How can I repair my dolphin in such a short time? A dense forest is visible on the surface below. As it holds the keys to my survival, I name it the Forest of Hope. I explore it tomorrow. The 30 day limit's pretty lenient. Leaves room for getting a part per day. Get multiple parts per day and you're in good shape. Yeah, I've heard- Generally, just, if you don't fool around too much, you should be alright. Also, hello, Zeal. Guess I would like to save my game. Since we're not playing a Wii game, it, 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 it doesn't need to warm up the infotation. And yeah, it tells me how many parts are in each area. Look at that motion blur on this thing. Okay, going on down, shooting star. Oh, hey, it's this song. Hmm, and there's two other onion spots. I wonder what that could mean. I really love the presentation of this game. <laughs> yeah, it's good. I, it's got, it's got very, it's, it's got flair. My dolphin has returned to the surface along with the Pikmin's onion. Bing. Being alone on this planet makes me somewhat uneasy, so I shall call the Pikmin out of the onion. All I need to do is stand in the light beneath the onion and press A. Yeah, so you get to choose how many Pikmin to take out. 
I reckon there's no reason right this second not to do them all. Oh, and there's a Munster over there. Okay. We can get more. Okay. Oh, yep. Now, see, there's a Yeller. But I don't think I can do anything with that. Uh, no, let's see. I need to have these guys doing something. Can you guys do anything with this? It doesn't look like it. It looks like that is a alternate Pikmin thing. Okay, I'm going to get this one just to see if that, like, triggers the yellow onion. But if it doesn't, then I won't, I won't get any more of them. Okay, no, that seems to... That seems to have just gotten me a red. Well, I mean, I don't know, maybe I still should get them, I don't know. Okay, come on, come on. Oh, oh. Now what was the... Oh yeah, it was R. It was R to make it go further out. Generally, I think I'll be doing the, the mid-range one. Okay, they're, they're trying to beat it down. I'm not sure if it's working, though. Oh, no, wait, there it is. We're getting there. I wonder if I, if I get a couple and like, throw them on top, maybe. I was sh I saw a video recently from when Pikmin was shown at E3 and people laughed as the Pikmin engaged in labor. Ah uh, yes. You see, it is a metaphor for American capitalism. Oh. He, he tried to eat him. Tried to, tried to get him. Maybe if we go from behind. There we go. Okay. Okay, get it, get it. Okay. Oh yeah, get the bulb, get the bulb orb corpse. Get the corpse. Good, good, good. But now I only have like two Pikmins to help me. No, wait, there's some more stuff over here. Okay, grab that, grab it. Okay, let's head back to the onion, get some more picks. Also, yeah, everybody's like real excited about Pikmin 4 lately, and I'm I'm really happy for the Pikmin fans who are eating good. But yeah, like I said, I've I've n never like truly played this game, so I just I thought it wise to start with the original. Something I find fascinating about this series, though, is how varied the opinions seem to be. Like, I see a lot of people, like, if you ask 40 people what the best Pikmin game was, you're not going to get 40 different answers because there's only four of them. Well, technically five, but... Okay, kill. 
Uh, uh oh, one of them got dead. I think. Well, I didn't see a g no. They no, that's a that's a bulb orb ghost. Grab the corpse. I saved it. Okay, good. Now, how many I need to carry this? Why? It's the Eternal Fuel Dynamo. It has an unlimited energy supply. Give. Give. I won't have to worry about saving electricity anymore. This will make my fight for survival a bit easier. How many do I need to get this? I need 40 picks. Which I do not quite have at the moment. So let me get the, uh... Let me get to 10. And then these guys can get these. But then I still have many picks left. I have 16. Oh, I lost the oh, I lost a couple. Oh. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. But now we got a big corpse, so at least there's that. I don't know. I can restart from the last save. Uh, do, do I know what the numbers at the bottom represent? I'm pretty sure that's total pick. Oh, that it's like Pikmin I have with me. Uh, Pikmin of specific color, and then total Pikmin. If I had to guess. My clock has indicated the coming of noon. From now on, I must pay close attention to the sun meter on my monitor and choose my actions accordingly, so it is best for me to review my monitor's data. Across the top of my monitor are the sun meter and the day display. At the bottom are my spacesuit damage meter and Pikmin gauges, and <laughs> from the left reflect the Pikmin under my command, the Pikmin in the field, and total Pikmin. Uh, okay. To adjust my monitor, I can press L to rotate the camera- yes, R to zoom and Z to change the view- yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we got a lot of picking to do. Picking the mins. So basically when you when the bar gets real far to the end, you got to you got to come back. I play Majora's Mask. I I know. After the great pickpocalypse that has just gone down. I, I need to replenish my numbers. Like, I, you know, I have no idea what an acceptable loss of Pikmin looks like, so <laughs> I apologize in advance. Okay, get, get. Yes, yes. Oh wait, he's- oh wait, that's the corpse. I was like, he's back? What? Definitely want to get the Bulborb corpse before I leave. Okay, so you have a max of two. So, I'm pretty sure that it's like... You can have more Pikmin than necessary carrying a thing to speed it up, but there is a max number that you can have on a given item. So again, it's all about delegation. Eternal Fuel Dynamo. This should light things up. No more candles for me. I have now recovered two out of 30 parts. If I can find just three more, I should be able to increase my ship's capabilities.
Yeah, the Pikmin are not terribly strong. What they what they lack in strength, they make up for in sheer numbers. And there is strength in numbers. Okay, how many need to be on? Okay. So, the rest of y'all can beat down this wall. Yeah, the rest of y'all kill the wall. And that's that's what how we'll spend the rest of this day. But I mean, listen, if I end up screwing things up, then, you know, I, I don't necessarily mind having to do this again. I understand that Pikmin 1 is not a super long game. So if I got to like replay it and make better choices, I'll do that. That being said, I probably will back up my save files because, you know, it, it doesn't hurt with a game like this to have backups. Okay. You know what? We can probably... Oh, there's an onion over there. Okay, don't don't wake that guy up. And you know what? We can we can grab a couple of these. See, can we go around this guy? Yes, we unlock the yellow. Yellow pick. Yellow pick. Yes. You got the pointy ears. The color is different, but it seems to be a Pikmin nonetheless. First glance suggests this one has what, in some circles, would be considered very large ears. It looks like it may weigh less than the others. In what other ways might it be different from the red Pikmin? No matter. They are obviously quite similar, so I shall call this one a Pikmin as well. Okay. So. Dismiss. Yeah, and they go into like... No, 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 no. No. No, no, no! I want the yellow man to get it! Stop. Stop. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I- I may have, uh, awoken that man. You know what, uh, let's, uh... Let's just head back. Maybe we can, uh, get past- oh god. Oh god. Get past him. Get past him. Yeah, cause it's getting- it's getting a little late. Can I just- wait, can I just leave the- the pellet here? Answer quickly. Can I just leave it here? Oh wait, actually, that- that one's the yellow guy, so... No, he actually needs to go into- it'll disappear? Okay, well then... Whatever. It is what it is. Alright, pick these guys real quick. Dandori. The next day, I mean, yeah, yeah, I, I understand. Okay, so, question first. Do I need to manually deposit the Pikmin into the onion, or is it just enough to have them with me? Was D-pad Pikmin selection added in two, or was that also in one? Well, we'll find out in just a minute. It's enough to have them with you, okay. I've recovered two out of three ship parts. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Have them with you or near the campsite, but preferably with you. If they're in the base by the ship, they're also safe. Okay. Oh, okay. No, so you just gotta... 
So go to sunset. I'm assuming you do not wish to fly too close to the sun. Oh, some of these guys got some bulbs. Alright, get me in there. The day ends automatically. It can be good to also do stuff even up to the end of the day. So, okay, so this is very important. Gonna affect how I play very heavily. If the day ends and you are still out, are you okay? Like, do you need to be back at the base camp before the day ends? You're fine if the day ends when you're not near the base. Okay, well then, yeah, I'll just... I'll just try to do as much as I can then. It appears many of my ship's part has landed in, have landed in this region. If I can recover the part of my radar, I should be able to use my radar screen. How that would improve my chances. Then I'd only have to press Y to locate my parts. Yet... There seem to be many hostile life forms here. If I'm attacked and my spacesuit takes damage, I must return to my ship, stand in front of it, and press A to make repairs. As I explore, I must pay attention to my suit's damage meter in the bottom left corner of the screen. Yeah, so you get a you get a summary. And you even get a little chart of uh the Pikmin population. Alright. And now we got the yellow on onion. And I do know that there is a blue onion as well. Yeah, so, so the main important thing is just have the Pikmin, like, at attention. Oh, there's some more bulbs over there, so... Oh, hey. Oh, they come back? Some of them come back? Well then. Get some more yellers. Go. Go, call forth your brothers. Okay, so it looks like new new pellets grow, but it might take some time. So I'm gonna take maybe 40 yellers out of here. I mean, 40 reds. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. No. Don't do that. Don't put me in the onion. Okay, so let me see. Okay, so pressing... It doesn't seem... Pressing down on the D-pad makes Olimar lay down. And they like take him... They take him back. But it doesn't seem like I can select different Pikmin. It seems like I just have to do this. Like, I just have to do it the old-fashioned way. So get my reds all together. Get them red boys. Okay, so there's a big man over here. We're really gonna need to take care of that. So, what if I get some of these? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, okay. Oh. Okay, okay, we got him. If you're holding a Pikmin and press left or right on the D-pad, it might switch which color you're holding. Oh, I see. Okay, now you fellers, uh... 
you can't pick this up. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. So, oh, I, I don't know if I want to uh, knock that down yet because if I knock that down and I'm not there to take care of it, then I, I feel like there might be death. Uh, no, it doesn't seem to be the case. Granted, I don't have y any yellow in the party. Yeah, so carry, carry this guy fast. Carry him fast. Oh, no. No, get back here. Oh, okay, those, those guys were not plantables. They were just... Already there. Yeah, so the mon the monsters are good for more Pikmin too. I don't know if I should be waiting around for these guys to to sprout, but nonetheless, that's what I've done. Okay, so what I think I want to do, I want to have the yellows like increasing their numbers. Like the yellows are not yet, there are not yet enough of them to where they are expendable. No, 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 don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. I need that. I need that to live. A little on the slow side. <laughs> Come on, boys, pick up the pace. Okay, now. Dismiss. Yellow men. I need you to get this pellet. Get this pellet as well. I think I'm gonna focus on uh, quantity. Like, it doesn't matter how fast they get it there. I just want them to get it there. Okay. So now that that's taken care of, for the most part, I'll, I'll let the red guys uh, take these last two, probably. A couple of y'all take that. Okay, now Restius. Rest is, we're gonna break down this wall. Just smack it with your faces. It'll be fine. Well, it's not coming down so far. Oh, yeah, it's one of the stone walls. Never mind. I need the, like the bony wall. And like I said, you can't you can't pick this up. No, they cannot. Okay. So, we need another plan. New plan is required. Well, there's more reds. Oh, hey, look at that guy. Get, get the, get that, get that stuff. Get the honey. Get the honey. The honey. Another intriguing discovery. A local variety of grass produces a sort of yellow nectar. When Pikmin drink this delicacy, they instantly mature into flowers. This apparent Pikmin seems to be full of nutrition. Apparent Pikmin favorite seems to be full of nutrition. I mean, apparently the Pikmin are full of nutrition too, or at least the Bulborbs think so. Closer observation is needed to determine the strengths and peculiarities of these flower Pikmin. But, nonetheless, it is good for me. And grab these.
Okay, so pick... Pick them in. And then we need to go back out. I think... The flower makes them stronger. Okay, so... We have mini mins. Mini mins are had right now. In fact, we can have even more than that. Grab, grab. The text that appeared actually spoiled something. Well, if it was, I didn't notice what it was. Well, I don't know, we're not... Even the flower Pikmin don't seem to be making much. Or wait, maybe they can pick- maybe- oh, they could probably pick up the explosives! Oh, the explosives! Hang on, we'll- we'll find out. Hang on, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. Yes, he's got one. Oh no, it's the yellow man. The yellow Pikmin have picked up some peculiar stone. Why did they decide to grab them? This active seems this act seems to be instinctive to yellow Pikmin. But what are these strange glowing stones? Brightly glowing cracks cover them. Perhaps these cracks indicate that there's tremendous power locked away within. This merits further research. Okay, yellows. Yellows grab. Come on. Come on. Oh, bug! 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 Oh, no, no, no! Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! Okay, the bug... No, no, come back! Come back! Okay, then. Don't do that again. <laughs> Whatever you- whatever you do. Explode it! No, wait, no, wait, wait, okay, dismiss, dismiss. 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 Come on, how do I throw the ones with the rocks? Uh-oh, we got a problem now. Oh, yeah, there we go. The glowing rocks the yellow Pikmin picked up seem to be explosive stones. Perhaps they know these stones could be used as powerful weapons. The bomb rocks are dangerous, so I must take care when using them. But they should be able to blast open the stone walls that block the pathways. I may even be able to use them against some of the wild creatures. I must be vigilant. Pikmin I dismiss by pressing X bring their bombs when I call them back. Pikmin I pr throw with A drop their bombs when I call them back. Keep clear of the, keep clear of the explosion. When I touch Pikmin directly, they keep their bombs and fall in line. Okay. Yeah, I'm pressing the D-pad left and right, nothing's happening. Uh-oh. Okay, I, I may have allowed that man to die. Okay, so I'm missing a couple men. There's one back here, I think. You blew up more Pikmin than that. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. And I think the one... Yeah, this guy. This guy. Okay. So everybody's accounting for. All the yellows you threw behind the gate have perished. Oh, my bad. Overwhelm him. 
Overwhelm him with numbers. Oh, that's a 20. That's a 20 boy right there. Oh, but only the yellows can get up there. So I need more yellows. Okay. Wait, there's a guy up there. I see him. Yeah, there's no there's no use for you being up there, feller. Oh, no, no, no. Don't. 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 He's in eating mode. Get him from behind. My clock is indicating the approach of sunset. Pikmin waiting beneath the dolphin and the onions will probably enter the onions on their own. But if I don't call the stragglers and add them to my group, they may not be able to get back. I'm sure that the Pikmin still planted are safe, but I am somewhat concerned about leaving Pikmin to fend for themselves in the darkness. Okay, okay. So I didn't get a ship part this day. That's that's not great. But hopefully I should be able to make up for that tomorrow. Where... Do these guys count as being in the field? Yes, they do. Okay, I missed one of them. But he said he thought they should be safe. I now add yellow Pikmin to my list of discoveries. These creatures can wield bomb rocks, so perhaps I can use them to blast down rock walls and open new regions. Red and yellow Pikmin, as well as bomb rock carriers, break into squads when dismissed with X, and when I grab one for a moment when by pressing A. Okay, so... Bomb rocks separate into their own groups. Okay, so... Pretty good. Pretty good. I wish I could, like, stagger my saves, though. Like, save into different slots. That would be cool. Okay. Let's go back in. We got a 20 there for the yellows to get. Yeah, so he's still there. Red man is still there, so it's not a big... It's not a big deal. You don't have to pick them all. Oh, so I think... Maybe about... 30 of these guys. And now how many yellers do I got? Only 12. Which is less than ideal. Oh, more nectar. More nectar. Yes, yes. Is 
Is that like grass related? Did they do it for the grass? I don't know. Anyway, everybody fall in line. Swarm as many into it as you can. Yeah, that seems to be the thing. That seems to be the thing. Okay. There's a rock wall over- oh, there's a part. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What are you? Oh, it's just like a little grub man. Oh, one Pikmin died from that. Yeah, to carry- get them out of here. Kill, kill, murder, feast, feast on the bones. Oh, there's a part right there. Okay, I don't like how many monsters are right here. I I should probably come back with some more men. Oh, no, don't do that. There was, no, there was nothing to gain from that. Speed that up. Speed up the process. Oh, yep, the, the yellow's got some new dudes. The yellow's got some new dudes. But I know the location of two parts, so that bodes well for today. I still do not have enough yellers, though. I need to get that 20 pellet. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. There's a lot of monsters we gotta deal with. But you know what, boys? I believe in you. You can do it. Oh, there's... There's a... Like a... Bone wall right here. Bone wall Jackson. Maybe that's not the best use of my time. All right. All right, boys. Kill. 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 Commit wanton murder. Okay, there we go. When there's tall grass, Pikmin can pick it and get nectar from it. Okay. It's my whimsical radar. With this, I'll be able to see all nearby ship parts in a single glance. I just have to press Y to check it. This fills me with great hope. Okay, now get it, get it quick. It's just you and me, boy. It's just you and me. Actually, you know what? You gotta, you gotta get this corpse. Can you get it? Yeah, he can get it. So is this tall grass right here? No, that's clovers, right? I need to know what I'm looking for. There's some at the camp. Like, oh, that right there. Radar! This important part can detect the locations of other missing parts. The radar will be added to my monitor, which I can press Y to view. Z zooms in and out. This will surely help me in my search for the remaining parts. I have now recovered three out of 30 parts. If I can find just two more, I should be able to increase my ship's capability. And I, I understand, I can read I can read between the lines that, that Olimar's planting here. He's, he's saying I need that many more parts before I can go to a new area. <laughs> I know game game designeries. Gamer instinct, yes. Okay, I need that. I need to get the 20 pellet for the yellow Pikmins. 
Yeah, so we're doing we're doing good. We're doing good today. How many is this? Oh ho, so we have enough. Go, my son. Pick up the pellet and prosper. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I love this game. Yeah, I know you do. And I know I know a lot of people that do. And honestly, I, I see why. I understand why a man could love this game. Okay, you boys break down the wall. And yeah, it says right here. And I guess the stars are the ship parts, yeah. Yeah. So very helpful indeed. Well, how about this? I'll let you I'll let you boys take care of that. I'm gonna head back here. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of yellers. That's a lot of yellers. So we have many more yellers now. Okay, get to get to tall grass. Get in there. Swarm. Get the juice. Get the juice, boys. Yeah, drink it up. Drink it up good. Okay, now let's check back on these guys. Have you made any progress, my sons? They have. They have indeed. But it might be best to break down... Where was this? That wall over there. Well, that might be what I do. Vinny Video is sending me a DM. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. So, I need to retrieve some bombs? Let's do that. And yeah, the yellow- the yellow- the flower pikmin move faster. I bet I know what that DM is about. Uh, maybe, but right now- right now he just said hello. I don't know, sometimes he just likes to chat. Bombs? You want it? I made yet another Pikmin-related discovery. I did? Just when I was about to exceed a hundred Pikmin in the field, the onions stopped expelling seeds. Yet the total number of Pikmin continued to climb. It seems that there, once there are a hundred Pikmin in the field, subsequent seeds get stored inside the onion. Thus, no more than one hundred Pikmin in the field can be, can be in the field at one time in any area. If we were to exceed this, the FPS would tank. <laughs> Honestly? Like, okay, so yeah, a, a famous, like, little piece of the backstory for this game. Is that a bug? Oh, no, that's a bug I couldn't kill last time. Nah, don't worry, don't worry. Do I throw, can I throw stuff at him and that will help, maybe? Oh, yep, yep, that's what you gotta do. You throw at him. Knock him over. Oh, yes, it, and he gives... Oh, okay, so yeah. 
That's good. That's what you want. Now, what else was there? Okay, so got a few of my yellows right here. Okay. Oh, no, not that way. Oh, crap. No, don't do that. Do not... Do not throw. Ah, so the, the radar tells you where the stray Pikmin are. Okay. Yeah, so you get the colored dots. Okay, cool. You know what? Okay, dismiss... You boys. Come with me. Fire in the hole. Okay, so far. <laughs> oh, wait, there we go. There's there's one. We might need more bombs than this still. Oh, no, wait. Come back. Oh, you, you smell that dandori? You smell the dandori? Oh, okay, so that, that might be the quicker way is to take care of it that way. Okay, so I only got... I've only got one ship part so far, but... I have a head start on the next one, so that's good at least. So I just kind of grab a couple yellows on the way over here. And those guys are over there. They should be fine. Those bombs are gone, so I need to find some somewhere else. And there are some right here. Bombs? You want it? Come on. Come on. Come on. Nobody left behind, soldier. Oh, and there's some bombs right here, too. Are you okay, dude? Is he- is he alright? I like- I like that there's different music for when the day's ending. All right, cool. So that's a shortcut over there. Okay, so probably not wise to go after that. But like I said, it's right there. Okay, so we are we are good. Like I said, head start on the next part. Just gotta, just gotta walk in and grab it. Mm, pardon me. He shall return shortly. <laughs> that takeoff sound effect sounds sounds like very, like crushed. I've seen that at times. The leaf atop a pigment's head will grow into a bud and then a flower. It appears as if I do not pick up the pigment sprouts. They gradually bloom over time. 
fascinating. The melting of plant and animal traits surely unique in the natural world. I have found that the increased swiftness of flower pigments to be of tremendous benefit. Also, my diligent observation has recorded instances in which flower pigmen lost in battle have seeds left behind. This is on why on days after fierce battles, I occasionally find new sprouts growing. Alright, good. Cool. So if you... So what I'm learning is, if there are pigment sprouts, and you just kind of leave them there, then they will flower on their own. So there's a benefit to just sort of leaving the sprouts unpicked. Okay, so... I think 30 of each would be a good number. Do you find this game stressful so far? Uh, maybe a little bit, but not too much. If you leave them too long, it'll revert to leaves. Uh... Which is only the case in the first game, go figure. So you just kinda gotta... be there. Or be square. I mean, either way, it doesn't matter to me. Okay, grab this thing. It's the extraordinary bolt! I bought this incredible bolt because the salesman told me that it is of extraordinary quality that is indiscernible to the average person. <laughs> exactly what makes it so extraordinary is a secret, but just look at it! Extraordinary! Olimar would probably buy an NFT. He, he would be suckered into buying an NFT. And there's that guy over there. Well, let's explore this way. Oh, and there's a part right over there. Kill, kill, murder. Yes, the bolt! Have you guys ever, like, anyone who's ever taken anything apart, do you guys ever have, like, nightmares about having, like, a bunch of screws and then dropping them everywhere? I've had those. I don't know what that says about me. This bolt's bolt holds the kind of value that only a true connoisseur can understand. I have now recovered four out of thirty parts. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes I just- I just have nightmares about dropping screws everywhere. I- I think that's kind of like an OCD person nightmare. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. What is this? Oh! You can just go right- you can go right through? Was that there the whole time? And yeah, some of the monsters come back. But it doesn't matter too much. So yeah, I'm gonna just... I'll just leave these guys here. I'll come tend to them in a little bit. I had a fucked up dream last night. Nothing involving screws, though. Oh, well, he doesn't know... He doesn't know the screw nightmare. Oh, but they don't, they don't, they don't all understand. They don't all understand the whole. All right, now. Murder! Murder! Kill! Kill! That is more Pikmin than I probably would have liked to have lose to that guy, but you know. Whatever, his corpse will nourish us.
smush him. Smush him good. Okay, now there are bombs over here. I found the Nova Blaster. This emits a dazzling burst of light, create capable of destroying almost anything. I'm not exactly sure about this, but the promotional brochure claims that its blast can travel in the currents of space-time, smashing through stars and the rifts into the rifts of space. And they're probably overselling it. Aw, oh, crap, I need more dudes. I don't have enough dudes to carry. There's also whatever this is. Yeah, I need I need more mins to carry this back. But don't worry, we will get it. We'll get it done. Still have not, like, changed state yet. You know what? You know what? Uh, get this. Y'all get this. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Get in it, get in, get in, get in there. Okay. Oh wait, some of them have started bulbing. Some of them have started bulbing. Dandori. Dandori. Okay, get, get this. Here, get this, get this real quick. Very practical way to carry a thing. This is a weapon of such incredible destructive force that it can blast stars into tiny pieces. It has a strange allure. I've recovered 5 out of 30 parts, increasing the dolphin's capabilities. My search can now cover a wider area. Oh, there's a flower. Oh, they're flowering. They're flowering, you guys. Oh. I don't I don't mean to pick up all of these, but Okay. Okay. Anybody out in the field anywhere? No. Okay, now where where is part? Mm, there are a few parts. One is up there, one is in north. And I'm guessing this is water. So if, if I want another part, I can go backwards and then around. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh, well, I guess we're fighting this guy now.
Yes! Yes, fall down! Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Become flowered. Become flowered. Oh, even more. Even more. Get him. Get him. And yes, the radar is very good to have. Whoa, they're fast. They are fast. Those men are booking it. They are booking it. Okay, any more flowers? Yes. Okay, picking. Oh, a couple of red flowers. Okie dokie. Anybody... Anybody MIA? Nope. Okay. Come on. Come on, boys. Come on. Grab a couple bombs. We're gonna need to break down a wall. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see what you mean by the tripping. I see what you mean. Now where where is it? Oh, okay, it's over here. Okay, split up. Bomb dudes. Need need y'all. No, not you. Not you either. Not you. Okay, I'm gonna need- I'm gonna need you guys to, like, buzz off. There you go. Okay, now everybody gather up. Hmm, the bomb throwing men. I don't I don't need the bombs anymore. Okay. Oh, so you can Oh, you can leave a whole bunch of bombs at once. Okay. Okay, now we will have to commit murder. We will have to commit it simply and effectively. And th but sometimes the monsters trip too, so that's very good to have. So you gotta- you just gotta be fast on the draw to call them back. Oh wow, that, that was a really good fight. That was a really good fight. Okay, I, I think I'm just gonna walk past these guys. Don't go in the water, please. Okay, so Not sure what I'm supposed to do with this. Maybe I'm supposed to push it the other way 
Yeah, I'm guessing I have to get on the other side of it, maybe. Let me see. I, w I don't know how to do that, though. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, I have a good idea, but I'm not sure if it's safe to do at this time of night. I should probably start gathering my Pikmin, as they say. Oh wait, there's some- there's yellows up there! There's yellows up there! Oh my god. Come on, dudes. Get with it. Anybody else? No, everybody else seems to be accounted for. Is there anything else I can be doing here? I mean, there's a part over here, but you gotta go through the water. Okay, so probably what I need to do is get the blue Pikmin. And then I can come back here and get more done. Hang on, let me- let me pick. What can I pick? Okay. <clears throat> also, yeah, the dark, the dark stuff on screen looks fairly good as far as I can tell. Oh, wait. Oh, did I forget some? Did I forget a couple? Yeah, I guess so. The Pikmin that I did not bring back to the Onion all vanished overnight. It may well be that they have fallen prey to the plant's nocturnal creatures. An ugly thought. Perhaps that is why they follow me into the atmosphere. I am starting to grasp the cycles of life on this planet. Hmm. Yellow population went down a little bit. I lost 24 in battle. And yeah, I left two behind. The forest navel. Yeah, so it's a little dark. A little bit darker. This is very like Wario Land-esque music. In fact, I think this is a sample that's used in Wario Land. Okay, so there's a stone wall there. Which I'm not a huge fan of. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Need to break this down. Oh, it's a bread bug! It's a bread bug! I see him!
Unfortunately, he will have to die. You all understand. No. Come on. Come on. Get around that. What, what is this? What are they doing? They're cracking the bones? Smash the bones, release the paste? Alright, you know what? You guys have fun with that. I'll leave you to it. Oh, wait. Did they do something? They did. Uh, I don't know what they did, but they did it. Now, what am I looking for? Is that a slingshot? Certainly not, right? Oh, that thing. I don't like that thing. Oh, wait. Wait. I mean, I think I got all flowers here, so I don't know if I really need that. I mean, I wish I had some more to turn into flowers, but... They are building me a bridge. I'm, I'm scared of this. Right here. What is this? Nothing? Well, you know what? They're getting the honey anyway. I wish... Uh, it's harmless? Okay. Well then, I think I might know what it's for then. Alright. Stairs constructed. Oh yeah, it's... Yeah, see, that's what I... I had a feeling about that. That's a water geyser. What is this? Oh, it's a pole. Oh, a bread bug! Bread bug! Oh wait, he's not... He's not doing nothing. He's just... He's just hanging out. Oh, okay, so they deposit themselves up there. Now I feel bad for saying he had to die. I mean, he probably still does, but you know. But he wasn't doing anything to me. Can I guide the Pikmin off a ledge? Is that something that can happen? Yes, it is. Okay. <laughs> Worth knowing. Yeah, I can- I can see how you could lose some Pikmin. Oh, there's the blue onion. But first, let's get the gear. Well, you know what, let's- I found the automatic gear! This thing chugs right along at its own pace. It makes piloting much easier. Giving me time to concentrate on the finer points of space travel. Alright, well, the problem is... The blue onion is, uh, underwater, which is, well, maybe, maybe I, Olimar himself can go over to it. That might, that might be the trick. So get dismissed. Yeah, okay. That's, that's it. You just gotta walk over to it as Olimar. And yeah, the power of the blue one is that he can go into water. He can go into water. You know how- you know how plants are terribly allergic to water. It is a pigment of yet another color. Near this one's cheeks is what appears to be a set of gills. This trait suggests to me that the blue type of pigment can enter the water without any trouble whatsoever. There's only one way to find out.
All right, cool. It has thin cracks running through it. I tried to fill them with dirt. I hope it will be all right. I've now recovered six out of 30 parts. Yeah, so six more parts before we can go to a new place. There aren't that many new places in this game to go to. Yeah, want to be careful before you go through the water, because the blue Pikmin, you know, they can do it. They can handle it just fine. But the other kind, you don't want to do that. <laughs> you do not want, you don't want to do that, man. Trust me. Trust me, babe. You don't, you don't want to play that game. Pikmin for the Nintendo GameCube, that is. You actually do want to play that game. I'm, I'm lying to you. It is, a, it is actually quite a good game. Has anybody ever thought, like, besides me, that Olimar looks like Billy from Billy and Mandy? He, he's just got that kind of nose. You nose. All right, and now we have mini blues. Mini blues are now had. Billy is his son. Oh my gosh. You know, we only assumed that Billy and Mandy took place on Earth. It actually takes place on Hakatate. And the Grim Reaper is like an inch tall. But yeah, see, the thing is, you go somewhere the Pikmin cannot follow. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Where are you going? Where are you going with that? I mean, I guess as long as they make it back. Pikmin AI kind of funky on the little. Yeah, that seems to be the case. I mean, as long as they get there. That's the important part. Okay, but there is some fire to be had around here. That much I know. Now, where does this take me? There's like the pools. The water pools. I should probably be behaving more proactively at the moment. I'm kind of just trying to get my bearings here. Is there anybody like hanging out? Oh, there's two that I didn't pick over there. Red book. <laughs> They're not even trying to attack it. Like they they won't even do anything to it. They're like, nah, man, this is a this is a battle you gotta fight on your own. Anybody hanging out? No. Okay. 
So we'll go this way. Can't can't go beyond that wall. Or that one. Now you know we got a we got a couple non uh non flowery ones. So come on boy come on boys, come get your juice. Come get your juice. Okay, now there's one of them fire boys over there. Probably want to have a red, the my reds fight him. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't like that, but he seem it seems to be blocked. Uh-oh. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. Split up. Red. Keep the other guys over there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the red guys are fireproof. Uh-oh. I might need to come back here. But I have more day to spare. Oh, no, no, take that. Some enemies can be swarmed for quicker attacks. Yeah, like I said, they just, they will not attack the bread bug. What did bread, what did bread bug ever do to you, huh? Bread bug truly is just a wholesome boy. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do like one more day and then I'm gonna probably stop. I think, I think that would be good. But now we have all three types of Pikman. Yeah, get fucked. Deep in the cave, I discovered the in the forest. I encountered blue Pikmin. These blue fellows have something resembling gills on their cheeks, and they appear to be amphibious, surviving in both water and on land. The wonders of na nature never cease to stun me, even in this alien land. Honestly, though, nature nature is weird, my dude. Nature's crazy. Okay, I'm gonna go back in one more time. So I think I'm gonna want primarily reds if I go down there. And maybe like a couple yellows so that they can bolster their numbers. So for now, I'm going to get 
70 reds. And then I'll pick these yellow guys. Oh, there's a blue pellet down there. Now, where was that? It was like down here, right? Yeah. So there's a ship part. Right over here. All oh, right, there's these guys. Oh, ow. Couple deaths. Couple unfortunate, needless deaths. But there is... Oh, there's a flower. Well, what is that? I thought that was a ship part. Yeah, I'm gonna need to break these walls down some way or another. Okay, yellows, you guys stay back here. Me and the reds are gonna take care of this. But don't let Olimar get hit by the fire. The Pikmin can get hit by so much fire. This baby, this baby can take so much fire. Yeah, the red Pikmin, we, we have got so many reds. You know, actually, actually. Don't, you guys don't take that. You guys, uh, stay right here. And we're gonna, we're gonna get, let the yellows take it. Actually, let me, let me throw them into that flower first. I want to see if something happens. Uh, I mean, something happened. I don't know if that was good. But let me, let me get this corpse. Just when I was about to exceed 100. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, we, we know that. We know that. Oh yeah, get used to that. Oh no. Yeah, get 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 down the lead. Dandered, you insectoid bastards! Oh, oh no, no, no! Red bug, no! But my bridge gets debuilt. Okay, they'll they'll get here eventually. Oh, you want some tall grass, do you? You want some of that nectar? What, what's y'all's deal? What are you doing?
Okay, okay. So let's go down. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Pikmin came back out. Came back out. And where am I going for a ship part? Oh, to the left here. Okay, so will this go down? Hang on, let me pick this guy. Let me pick this man. I'm not sure what the benefit of this is. The darker gates are always stronger. Oh, I know, I know it's gonna take like longer, but... Like, do I need, do I need bombs for that? I probably need bombs. Whatever. You change reds into yellow. Oh, okay. Oh, what is this, a Wallywog? Weigh it down. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not doing good against this guy right now. And there's the mushroom man over there. Okay. Okay. Hmm, I don't know. That's a big- that's a big mushroom man. I think I want to get some more of my dudes back before I fight the big mushroom man. Now, which way I gotta go? Ah, uh, no, not this- not this dude. Is there one in the water? Okay, yeah, there's there's a couple in the water. So if I can get more blues, that would be handy. There's some flowers here. Okay, so you know what? We need we need to get a couple blues out. Okay, now I need to- I need to bolster the numbers of the blue. You guys, take- get these. There's a red down there. Okay. Probably wouldn't hurt to heal Olimar while I'm here. Okay, again, need to- need to bolster the numbers. Need more blues.
Oh, what is what is that? Thank goodness, my space float! This float is an absolute necessity for any pilot who lacks skill at swimming in space. Oh, okay. Is, is that a ship part? <laughs> okay, I guess it's a, a free ship part. Sure. It was inside the bread book. <laughs> An excellent swimmer like me has no need for something like this, but my motto is always be prepared. Really, it's just for emergency. I have now recovered. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now once again, gonna have him get these pellets. Because we need more blues. Abba dee, abba die. Baba dee, baba boo 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 boo. Put them back in. Put them back in. Now then. Is there, is there anybody hanging out? Yeah, there's a couple stragglers. And did I miss anybody? Yes, I did. Oh, they want to, oh. Bug. No, stop fighting that. No, 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 get back here. Get back here. Murder. Murder. Okay. Let them do their thing. I hope this goes well, but you never know. Oh no, they turned into- Oh, they turned into mushroom! Help! Oh, that wasn't good. This is a fine kettle of fish. So do they turn back? They do, right? Like that was a that was them turning back once I beat them up, right? Well, I guess we'll, we'll see the, the chart. Oh, 
Oh man, I left one dude. And he got squooshed. The Pikmin always carry their prey back to the onions. Close observation indicates that taking food pellets to the onions of the same color results in the release of a larger number of Pikmin seeds. I've also found ways to group Pikmin by color. I can hold A to grab one for a moment, or I can press X to dismiss them all. Hmm, let's see, uh... Oh, I left seven behind. For a total of nine. Fifty-eight were lost in battle. But overall, population numbers are pretty good. Okay, well, that'll be it this time. We'll be back soon with more. Thank you for tuning in. I'm, I'm having a good time. It's a, you know, it's a little stressful, but it does work out good. You know, it's a good game. Fun times. I will see you later. And have a good Dandori day.